How about you? How about you? All right, because I have a perfect. Per Yo, perfect gravel. How is that possible? Yo, what's up, guys? I'm Black Hero, and in this Axie Infinity video, we're going to be hatching 16 eggs for 16 axes for Mad Fox Gaming Guild. By the way, guys, Mad Fox Gaming Guild is currently holding a scholarship program if you guys want to join links in the description below all right so yeah these are mad fox gaming axes if you guys have seen the previous video right where we bought these axes we bred these axes now it's time to hatch these double discard pokey axes all right we're gonna start from the latest the highest id that means we're gonna be doing the uh the the ones with snail shell then after that we're gonna do the sandal scarab and then we're gonna do the pokey plant and aquas it's gonna be very cool i'm really really excited hopefully we get what we want we hopefully we keep the purity of these axes intact all right so let's let's do these first okay we're gonna do with the first we're gonna do the first six because i know these are bugs with plant bug signal so one two three four five and six all right so here we go they have been ready since december 19th 2021 4 23 p.m all right so it's time to morph these axes into adults again these are the parents of these two i mean the, there's three of them all right so hopefully we can get some really good purities out of this so morphing to adult all right i need to unlock the ronin wallet i forgot <laughs> all right let's try that again morphing to adult i know it's already it's unlocked what do you want me to do? Refresh the page. I will refresh the page. All right, well, here we go. Refreshing the page so that it knows that my Ronin wallet is unlocked. There we go. Finally. All right, we're going to hit confirm. Your morph is still being processed. Okay, we're going to go do the next one. I think this is how people do it, right? Confirm. A morphing. All right, I wonder does it show as a tr activity? You no, know it doesn't. Okay, that's good. All right, hit refresh on this one. We're going to slowly morph them and hopefully we can get something good. It's going to be a surprise. All right, honestly, for this snail shell one, I really want something with double plant on the eyes and ears. That will be just beautiful. Beautiful. All right, uh, it will be a very tanky snail shell in the front line because I use the snail shells as a tank for the front line. All right, these have different parents. Uh, okay, so there we go. And then the last one for this snail shell Axie. All right, morphing time. All right, so once we hit the next button, we will see. Okay, nothing. No, okay, uh, all right. Uh, they're still saying all okay. I wonder if I just pressed okay. All right, so we, we just let it set a while. Let them evolve into the axie that they're supposed to be. They're meant to be. Hit okay, and then and then. All right, yo, perfect, perfect. Okay. Good, 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 good job. I'm like, yeah, that's when you breed purities. When you breed purities, ooh, uh, it's fine, it's fine. Lamb on R1, a perfect parasite, perfect fish neck, kingfish on R2. We, we, we can take this, we can take this. This is good, this is very good. All right, how about this one? All right, uh, oh, okay, we got the hollow, we got the hollow. All right, the parents on these are the hollow blossom. Okay, so really small chances for getting. Uh, plant bug part yeah, this is good because you know again we still got the cards snail shell all right let's see double pincer double ooh, double parasite triple okay see these are this is still good this is still breedable very breedable all right next okay all right for the second generation down boom all right here we go another win i'm like these are pretty much guaranteed if you if you look at the parents <laughs> all right lamp ooh mosquito Lamb, that's a bad R, that's a bad pincer, that's a bad mouth set, but I'm like, as long as we get the, the main pincer card, we're, we're good to go. Perfect parasite, perfect fish neck, and then snail shell has still kingfisher, alright, and then this one, alright, this is a different parent, hopefully we can get the Sakura, Sakura is a good card, okay, alright, really wanted, because see the parents on this is Pappy and Sakura. I really wanted a Pappy Sakura combo. If we can get a Pappy Sakura combo, yes, please. But we did get the cards that we wanted. Sticky shell. Okay, how, how about this traits? Yo, this is yo, this is beautiful. This is a hundred percent, hundred percent. This is a printer. All right, like except for the eyes and ears, but this is a printer. Look at that perfect printer, perfect parasite, perfect snail shell, perfect fish neck. That is beautiful. All right, 
Uh, I'm, I'm happy for that. I'm happy for that. About this, yo, let's go, let's go. This is actually what I wanted to bring. A poppy Sakura with a snail shell pincher parasite. All right, how about your other stats? Whoo! Look at that, double Sakura, and then it's another. <laughs> It's a tank printer. This is a tank printer. Yeah, I should breed more of these parents. These are looking so good. Oh, look at that. All right, I'm, 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 I have dibs on this, guys. I'm sorry. I'm going to have dibs on this. Unless the, the next one, the next one. Come on, double. Okay, all right. Still good. All right, all right. Okay, all right. Shiitake on R1. All right, I'll take it. It's not bad. I'm like, it has still Sakura. But yeah, I got dibs on this one, guys. I do got dibs on this one. All right, this is what I've been looking for. A tank printer. See, the difference is um, 2 HP. All right, 2 HP. All right, that, that's so cool. All right, so that is it for the tank bugs. All right, thank you guys so much. We got a, good, we got a couple of good wins, but we did get all the cards that we wanted. We hit refresh here, and uh, now there is now... 12, 10 axes left all right let's keep moving forward now these axes these are your snail shell or sat i mean snail sh <laughs> these are gonna be i because i bred i mixed bred them all right i i wish i didn't i honestly did I, all right if that's something i want to go back on but then i just was short on time so, but you know, Sandal and Scarab, Scarab does have the priority here, especially in late game PvP. But, you know, still combining these two are not that bad as well. Alright, so let's morph these into adults. Alright, because the Scarabs that I got, apparently I didn't check. They were siblings, so I couldn't breed the Scarabs together. I was gonna breed Scarab, Scarab, and then Sandal, Sandal. Alright, what happened was, I mean, because, you know, I got them at a good deal. All right, and then, <laughs> and then their their purity was just so good. I had to get both of them, and then it, it just didn't occur to me that they would actually be siblings. And then you know, with with the rules and stuff, you can't breed siblings together. That's just incest is a no no. That's a no no, guys. All right, so hopefully we can get lucky. All right, okay. What we want is scarab. All right, I I'm prioritizing Scarab, all right? I'm not going to be biased, but Sandal does hit hard on bugs, all right? It does offer more damage, but Scarab all the way. Boom. Come on, let's let's get this win. Okay. Sandal, all right? We'll take a Sandal. What's the purity on you? Sandal, Sandal, Scarab. All right. Marion R2, Princer, Perfect Fishnack. All right, we'll take it. Next. Come on, let's get that Scarab. There you go. There you are. And then everything else is good. All right. Double Scarab Sando. Marion Parasite. Perfect Pincer. Perfect Fish Neck. Beautiful. All right. Again, we don't want any. And we want perfect uh, bug parts all, all throughout. All right. For the morale. And then we don't want that extra speed. All right. I'm making speed is good. But we, we want the perfect bug. All right. Okay. Good. Sando. So it's a 50 50. All right. We got a Sando here. And then how about four jeans? We got rice on our one. Aside from that, everything else is perfect. Pincer, scarab, parasite. Ooh, scarab, scarab. So yeah, I'm like when you when we crossbreed these together, uh, like we we can get some good outcomes later on. So, all right, come on, let's get us. This is a different pair. This is a different pair. All right, sandal again. Sandal is very dominating. How about the jeans? Perfect pincer, perfect. Okay, sandal, scarab, scarab. Again with the double scarab. Or right, thorny on R two. That's 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 doable. That is doable. All right, come on. Can we get another scarab? Sandal. Wow, sandal. Wow, wow. A lot. That's a lot of red. That's a lot of red. A perfect pincer, perfect parasite. Sandal, scarab, snail. Oh, we'll take a snail shell. We'll take a snail shell. Fish neck and then thorny on R two. All right, this is our last hope to get at Scarab. Come on. For more sandals? <laughs> the Scarabs are on R1 and R2, although this is almost as close as you can get to a printer. This is 99%. This is 99%. All right, at least we got that win. 99%. So, in the next generation, when we breed, say, for example, this guy with this guy with the double, double Scarab on R2, that should increase the odds of actually getting Scarab. But we did get one, all right, with double Scarab. So that's a good thing, all right. 
Again, the cool thing about Sandal, I get 50% more damage against bugs and it has higher shield with 50 compared to 40. All right, so that is it for the mid laners. Congratulations. All right, now let us hatch these. Okay, so these are the the, the last four axes. We're going to start with the aquas first. We're going to do the aquas first. All right, so aqua axes, and then we're going to do the plants. All right, so here we go. So as you guys know, for the aquas, we're running um, pokey. All right, and then we want lamb. All right, I've, I really fell in love with lamb. Lamb is a good card. Right? Although it does make its lips thick. <laughs> but at least there's no hook hanging out. I think fish. I mean risky fish is a good card, especially against aqua I mean aqua against plants and reptiles. And dusk. Alright, here I really want Gravelant. Alright, this is perfect Gravelant and then this has Gravelant R2. So if we can get Gravelant for the plants, that would be a solid W. Alright. Come on. All right. Here we go. Moment of truth. Can we get lamb or are we going to get risky fish? Let's hit okay. And the suspense is killing me. What happened here? It's still morphing into adults. All right. So again, this has double pokey, triple pokey. Our odds of getting pokey are very high. We do want Nemo. All right. We want Nemo. This one right here has shrimp. We want to avoid that at all costs. So far amongst all our hatches we got all the cards that we wanted all right on the dominant genes all right hit refresh and okay all right swirl swirl we got pokey risky risky all right what swirl was so out left field I'm like swirl was on r2 but that will decrease this guy's speed by one at least it'll make it a little tankier but decrease its speed by one so we'll take it as long as we got Nemo, Risky Fish, and all these cards. It's still a very good Axie. Now it's your turn. Can we get that lamb? Can we get the lamb? Okay. This suspense is killing me. Refresh and. Uh, and. And. And devil. Really? You, you show me a blank page. Is my internet still working? Refresh again. Give me the lamb. Give me the goldfish. Risky. Pokey Nemo. But it's a perfect aqua. All right. Yo. Yo. Okay. Nemo shrimp. Grammy's fan. True. Perfect. It, it pretty much inherited the genes of its parent. Literally. Except for the lamb part. I mean. No. Yeah. It, it has triple. Look at that. Triple risky. Triple pokey. Triple goldfish. One Nemo shrimp. Grammy fan. That's exactly the same as its parent wow that is that is pretty good that is actually pretty good didn't get the lamb didn't get the lamb but that's fine i'm like risky fish is very dominating when i pair these two <coughs> sorry about that. all right now let's go for the plant for the plant i really want gravel ant come on bring home some gravel ants yes let's go let's go we got the gravel land we got the bidens we got the pokey and we got the zigzag again these the parents on this guy uh we did get the kataro eyes which is not bad uh but yo we had perfect gravel land on this guy gravel land on this one uh and we still pulled the gravel land this is gonna be very good it's also relatively faster but sea slug also gives hp even if it's just one so 52 health ain't bad uh, and you know it's not it's not the bad thing to be speed D or fast for this axie. All right, can we get another gravel land? Can we skip the hot butt and boom? All right, perfect health. I mean HP on 58 has hot butt. So yeah, this is gonna be a tank on the back line, right? Because see, gravel land is a bug card. All right, so you don't get that much HP because you don't get HP at all from bug cards. You only get morale and um. Wait, HP? <laughs> One HP probably? So yeah, with this guy, with um five. Alright, what's your genes? Alright. Perfect zigzag. Perfect pokey. Perfect Bidens. Yo, this guy is a hunt this is a printer. This is a these are good genes. It has Graveland on R2, which is fine, but you know, you pair this with a hot butt. Yo. How about you? How about you? Alright, because I have a perfect Yo! Perfect gravel! How is that possible from these parents? Wow, this, you can flip this. You can definitely print this 
Not print this. Flip this. Aside from its eyes and ears, everything else is just perfect mundo. Oh, look at that. Perfect zig. Ah, oh, you just gotta love to see that. That is that is more perfect than this guy that I bought. I'm like, this guy has perfect zigzag, perfect pokey, double Bidens, and then perfect gremlin. This guy is just across the board, 100%. A printer, if I do say so myself, if I could breed this with your mom, that would make some good... That would just sound so wrong. So yeah, I'm, I'm happy with the turnout. Uh, among all else, I mean, these aquas didn't get the land, but risky fish will definitely hurt against any reptile aqua dusk. Why do I say aqua? <laughs> Plant. And that is it for the egg hatching video. There are no more eggs here. Let us see all the 21 axes that we have here that we're going to be distributing for Mad Fox Gaming Scholarship. I will be doing that today because there's that 24 hour cooldown. But that is so, so pretty, all right? So yeah, that is gonna be it for this video. Hopefully you guys did enjoy it. And then I uh, are excited for Mad Fox Gaming Scholarship Program. Remember guys, link in the description on how to join. Make sure to join our Discord to stay up to date. I'm Black here, and until next time, see ya. <coughs> all right, where are you? Where are you, where are you, where are you, where are you? Where are you, where are you? I got dibs on you. Yes, you're going home to Papi. Get it, Papi? <laughs> uh, and you're a printer as well. Beautiful. Beautiful.